Uh, we might be doing the Sonic trailer with Corvo. I want to, I want to do the, the trailer watch with Corvo about the Sonic one since I found it finally. There's also watch the uh, Juju Kaisen movie trailer. Ooh, there's a Juju Kaisen trailer? Mmm, I'm giggling it up now. Give me a moment. <laughs> Play! Oh, great, the Winter Soldier. <laughs> These rings well, I'm asking because you tend to pause it. Well, yeah. So help me, Thomas. Okay. Um... Thomas at a wedding day don't recognize the brothers or rec what is, what is it is was that's, that the that's his sister-in-law okay that's why I was like remember the, the, remember the first movie she the one that one one of the yeah the one house. the divorce one the ones that wanted the voice over and over and over again yeah like leave his ass leave his ass yeah, and yeah. they're playing the sonic music on there is I'm, and that's sonic that's calling yeah it's sonic calling him and it's the sonic ringtone so is Sonic the video game in the universe too? I, I don't know. I, I don't know, but they definitely I have already they, seen the trailer, so I will be I, I get they that definitely, they definitely put the music in there. So I, cool. I tip the hat, I know the nudge, I know the, the joke, but I'm kinda confused. Alright, keep on going. Sorry, sorry. Oh, there's a lot to see. Sorry. Life or death situation, I need you to use the ring to save me. Like right now. No, my God. Okay, wait. So, was the ring like a red ring or like no, no, no. a? You don't, you don't remember the rings from? The yeah, movie? I remember it, but like, I can't help but feel like this is gonna be like, yeah, here's the ring and giving you the use of a wedding ring. Oh, yeah, we need to use this now to save Sonic. Uh that just so happened to give me. I think I think he was just wearing one for in the case of an emergency because it looks like he's at the sister in law's wedding. Uh huh. He goes south, so he just snatches that thing off and throws it. Gotcha. And like then an emergency exit. I wonder how early in the movie this is gonna be. Cause I don't know, because there's knuckles. Tails. I mean, yeah, tail. Uh, sorry. So and he getting chased by Doctor Robotics thing. Little, yeah, little robots. The little robots? Yeah. Okay. I'm, I, didn't I, see, I didn't see the little robots. That I'm little kind of interested. Like yeah, you go back a little bit. I'm kind of interested if uh, the little robots are being piloted by little little animals. There they are right there. Go back a little further. Like right now. No. Oh, yeah, that's definitely the... Uh... I, I don't like the puns. No, my God. That is, that's not a good pun. I, I don't. Well, you're not supposed to like her anyway. Uh-huh. So it's just, it, it just makes you not like her more. Just, okay, gotcha. Well, I just that thing about the first movie, they, they, it was full of puns. <laughs> yeah, it, puns were for days in, in, in the window jokes. I yeah. like, I like to have the, it's like they're implementing this whole teleporting ring thing more. It is... It's yep. a new twist to Sonic. Right. It gives, it gives the rings more meaning other than keeping your ass alive. Yeah, true. Well, in this well, case... That's, that's probably why that what they're trying to say is that's why it kept him alive. Because if, if he needed to, he could just... Yeah, teleport, you know, portal away. Portal away! <laughs> All right, let's yeah. keep on going. I'm at the snow part being pushed out. Yep, that, I'm right where they're getting knocked over by the snow. Okay, play. hope we are not too late. Oh lord, there are two of them now. What's happening? Uh, okay, quick version. Robotnik is back. Okay. All right, Robotnik is back. Robotnik is back. And he's still skinny. <laughs> I I don't mind it. And a ship carried. So like it. You know, yeah, it, it, it works for me right now because I mean. I get, granted, he doesn't have the physical build, but he definitely has the mental build. Oh, yeah. There. Fully. I, mean, I, I can't think of anybody else that could pull off Robotnik. I mean, here's a, here's another question, though. Do we really know what he looked like prior to when he started playing this game? I kind of hope they do show, like, him maybe, like, prior, where he got his, actually got his name from, being that his body was always shaped like an egg. Right. Well, you know, they alluded to it in the first movie. Um, because his name was Robotnik, but Sonic was calling him Eggman a lot. 
Mm -hmm. I think it's because of his head. No, he was calling it because the little drones look like eggs. He's like, all right, Eggman. Yeah, like everything he makes is usually in a some kind of alluding to an egg, you know, and some eggs are very durable. Uh huh. Triangle, they're structurally sound. Yeah, they're they're hard to crack from from top to bottom. Yeah, unless you hit in the right spot, but otherwise they can be pretty good. Uh, I I like him, but I would I wouldn't just want to just see just to see what he looked like if they put a fat belly on him, just a fat gut. I don't know why I just want to see a fat gut on him, just to see if it, maybe it would align a little bit more. They're liable, and we're not gonna go. Oh yeah, yeah, I get you what you're saying, but I. They're, they're not able to get like, oh, well, now they're just making fun of us, or why didn't they just hire an actor that blah, 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 so it's just. Yeah, he, he fits he fits the mental all the way around, and I love it. Um, Let's keep it going. Uh, new droids, I see. Looks like, look like Wasp. I know the Wasp in uh, Super Sonic, or Sonic game, so there's the Wasp. I discovered the Knuckles. source of ultimate power. There's Knuckles. Get it back the world is doomed. And there's the um I slept on the, the pyramid. There's the the gems from what, uh, chaos, ca the chaos emeralds. Chaos emeralds, and only green is so far. So I guess this is the start of the chaos emerald um mm. story. Not just like uh, Eggman capturing animals to use them to power his machinery, which I'm still like kind of hoping they. Like, they put a squirrel inside of it. Like, just put a squirrel inside of it. At least I give it a little bit of a nod. Like, there it is. Animals in the robotics. But that's, like, an old story. Well, here's the thing, though. We don't know what happened on that planet. Yeah, see, a lot of people a lot of people forget that before Knuckles was a good guy, he was a bad guy first because he was tricked by Robotnik. Mm-hmm. So, this is probably going through that whole Knuckles is the bad boy phase. Oh, somebody asked me in my chat, who do you think would win, Dr. Eggman or Dr. Wally from Mega Man? And I would probably think my brain would go Dr. Wally, but that's just because he deals with more humanoid uh, intelligence. I don't really know. That's a good question. That's a good question. Okay, let's keep on going. I'm at the pyramid. And play. No, he's, he's like further. Oh, okay. Well, I'm, I'm at Sonic. Uh, Knuckles coming out of the ring. Face. Um, okay. All right. Play. When he, when he you rock some kind of. Else, mm. You're about where he's Space at. porcupine. Oh! I am an echidna. Or does something to somebody else. Space porcupine. Yep. But he's a a what? Echidna. Echidna. What does a? I'm I'm drawing a blank. What's an echidna look like? like a hot hedgehog. Okay. I, 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 it's like a hedgehog, but it's not a hedgehog. Okay, for some reason, I always thought it's Sonic. <laughs> I always thought uh, Knuckles were um a, a a one of those creatures with a bunch of spikes all over his back, like roll into a ball. Um, I used to have one. Is that a hedgehog? Porcupine. Yeah, I thought he was like a porcupine or something like that. No, like, and it can it can just, uh more like a he hedgehog, except that instead of they're young, if I remember right. Why am I using science facts? I have no idea, but if I remember right, they lay their eggs. <laughs> hey, so, works for orange and as mammals. Okay. Can... Mammals can't even talk. I'm just glad that they didn't do him dirty like the first Sonic movie, where they're gonna make his teeth all weird and facial features. Like they went, no, no, we're sticking to the cartoon look. Let's keep that going. You're not gonna pick off the the, the Sonic fans. Um I don't. We, like, we saw way too well on the first one, so let's keep it going. Yeah. Um. I. I don't really like this. This new guy they introduced. Like he doesn't really play very much of a deep role, and I'm kind of glad he doesn't. Like he's in the movies, but he don't play a pivotal role other than being Doctor Robotics, like Coffee Man, which I'm fine with. Don't don't make him anything special, please. Oh yeah. We're going. Hmm. <laughs> Hedgehog. It's time. Well, we got a tornado. To humanity. Yep. What? I'm sorry. I just stopped at the part where he came out of the out of the building floating like he was Jesus Christ with yeah. a with a uh, uh, a look that could match uh, uh, the Green Lantern core. What the hell is going on here? Eggman doesn't have that in suits. 
he possesses right now the chaos symbol. Oh, in that power. Oh, okay, I can see that. But it looks like he just came out of the Greek Galactic Corps. Just went, you know, no can escape my might. Where's his ring at? I I love it, but it's weird. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry. I gotta rewind. I gotta rewind. I want to see that again one more time. Like, Hold on, let me get there. Yeah, I'm at the part where they're pointing the guns at him. Play. The humanity. <laughs> That face he makes is great. This is your moment to be the big. Oh, I'm at the owl. I stopped at the owl part. Okay. Yeah, I'm right when they're fixing to the walk into where the owl is. All right. So <laughs> I recognize the owl. I know the owl plays a pivotal role, but that's like the owl in the other universe. Are they back in his unit or world, planet, whatever? The owl, the owl was like the Obi Wan Kenobi, the protector, the razor of Sonic, the one that knew all about Sonic's powers and shit. So she's supposed to be dead. At least mm -hmm. he thought she was because she she blocked the the ring passage for him to get away and fought off whoever was chasing him when he escaped in the first movie to Earth. So the fact that somehow when put on a mushroom planet that supposedly has no life, he has found Knuckles and the Owl and the Emerald, that's not a good thing. Yeah, it's like, it's, it's, if, it's as if the rings are directing you to Earth and to the Chaos Emeralds. It's like they're not even trying to, but the rings are like, hey, you go through this, you might find an Emerald. And some other people that's connected to it. Uh, I feel like the rings are like kind of like guiding them as if it's the owl that's doing it. That she's just like, hey, you use these rings? That's my powers. I'm directing you where you need to go. Ring, you want to go there? Go for it. You need, there's something there you're going to need. And I think that's how probably Dr. Doctor found it when he threw the mushroom one. And he didn't know Chaos Emerald. Which, honestly, I, that would be probably the best place to throw it somewhere where no one wants to go. A planet with nothing but mushrooms. Probably a good idea, right? Put a bad guy there. They're bad. Put them in a place where it's terrible. Yeah. Um. But I, I, I. Yeah. Yeah. Hide it. I'm curious. I'm curious of how. I'm curious how he found the owl though. Mm-hmm. That was supposed to be dead. Well, it's in a, it's a trailer. It's not gonna answer your question. Yeah. I, I, I want to know the answer, but also I, I'm, I'm thinking of theorizing the rings or her powers or. Their powers. No, no. Extension of her powers. Yeah. yeah, a connection to them. Okay, let's continue. Hero. Bad time to say this, but I don't actually have a plan. Got some puzzles. Hey, you got a little something. And a laser on and on uh tails his head. I wonder what could be there. Something <laughs> on your. Uh, Someone call an Uber. It's cold in here. Let's turn up the heat. Holy crap. All right, I have him pause where he's going down the mountain right now. Okay, so um, I guess Dr. Robotic is following Sonic and letting Sonic figure out the puzzles because he probably knows the answers to the owl. Maybe he knows some of the clues. So he's like, okay. Sonic knows his stuff, so I'm going to, I'm going to let him do the work for me, and I'm just going to benefit from all of it. Um, and this part right here looks gorgeous. I, I, I can't help but feel like they just took a, like a, a, uh, what's this, a draw, a draw, a draw, a draw, a draw, drown, and just like flew it through these areas, and then put Sonic into the view, because this, this looks beautiful. Yes. Like this, this is, this does not like CGI, well, other than Sonic, of course, but. I think he blends in very well. Continue. <laughs> and of course, the Winter Soldier. <laughs> Fear not, citizen. Ah, oh, the Winter Soldier. Negative attitude is not helping. We stick together. Oh, pause. Big robot. Um. Okay, I've already heard the Winter Soldier joke. Uh, joke one time. It's still pretty damn funny. I just feel like by the time I watch the movie, the punchline won't be there for me. I would, I would wish it. I kind of wish they didn't put it in there, but I get it. It's a trailer. They want to entice you. They want to introduce you. Uh, but robot, 
I can't help but look at this thing and think Juggernaut. Is that just me? Does that look like Juggernaut to you? Holy shit, yep, that's a Juggernaut from hell. That looks like Juggernaut. In the, I see the Chaos Emerald. It's it's away from Dr. Robotic, so I guess at some point Dr. Robotic loses it and Sonic go, is going for it. But that looks like Juggernaut, so I kind of love it, but at the same time, I just can't... I, 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 I get it. They're going for the round shape. Looking like an egg. Blah, blah, blah. Dr. Robotic. I don't see the, mush, the mustache on it. Is there a mustache on it? It looks like there could be. I can't, I don't know, I can't see it clear control. enough. Okay. Let's continue on. No matter what. You're unskilled. Yeah, there's a mustache. Untrained. Okay. What's green lights? Mmm. I paused it right when the green, when the green lightning came about. I'm kind of. I'm trying, I'm trying to think of who could it be, but I can't but think of it as to be Dr. Robotic right there, right? It's just gonna... Yeah, I would say. Unworthy. Yep. Uh, yeah. You forgot one. Unstoppable. I like their fighting. I do. I I like the idea of Sonic and Knuckles fighting, because at one time they were enemies of each other. But I hope at the end they they keep true to the storyline and they. Spoiler warnings for anybody who has not played Sonic video games. I don't know why you watch the movie if you don't know this already. They're not actually enemies. <laughs> I don't know if anybody knew that. They they are. At they yeah are. at this juncture. Yeah. They are right now because he thinks Sonic is the bad person. But <laughs> when he realizes Sonic is that's, that's why I said they not are the bad person, they are. it's a different story. Yeah, because every every villain it's thinks they're the good guy. Timeline. Yeah, like every 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 good every villain thinks they're the good guy. So like that's just how every they guys and every good guy thinks they're or every bad guy thinks they're a good guy and the good guys are sometimes the bad guys. Yeah, so it's just the way they, they work and I'm sure Dr. Robot, he's not stupid, he's probably, you know, puppeteering a little bit in the background. Um, I just okay, so for this movie, do you want them to focus more on the dynamic of Sonic and Knuckles? Or do you wanna do you want the enemy to still be the like really primary Dr. Robotic? I'm torn, man, because I love the dynamic between Knuckles and Sonic. I want that. But I also want that 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 villain from from Robotnik. Yeah, because like I, I like Sonic and I like Knuckles, but Dr. Robotic is Jim Carrey. I want him to see him play the villain. I want to see him I like I want to hate him. That that's the point of a villain. I want to hate him. And that makes a good villain. I think it's gonna be possibly equal parts. They, they, I hope they do get equal parts. Hope they don't like overpower it. It, it wouldn't make sense to just do just him, just mm. Robotnik. At the same time, it wouldn't make sense to do just Knuckles. Yeah, they're like Knuckles, not actually. A, well, he's a he's a dick, but he's a good her. dick. <laughs> Robotnik. Where Robotnik is manipulating behind okay. the scenes. Okay, easy there, Kitty Bear. His thumb easy, around. Kitty Bear. Oh, that's oh. great. Anyways, uh, but yeah, I, I, I want, I want people to realize at some point, like you know, or the, the viewer to re realize, okay, Knuckles, he seems like a bad guy, but he's actually a good guy, and Doctor Robotic is the pure dick, evil bad guy, prick. Hey, he's got to be a good dick though. So yeah, I, I, I'm looking forward to him to finish it here. Um. Sonic 2 coming out and what? Like a... Oh, I didn't see this part. Okay, a bunch of fast fists. Forgot he has fast fists. My name Knuckles, you are no, really worry. bad at punches. <laughs> he just finished though. April the 8th. Oof. Oh, let me see. Let me see. Yeah, One, right two, three weeks as of Friday? Three weeks? I want to see it in theaters, but I'm so scared. I don't want another. No. I don't... Well, for you, you have a good tra a theater near you. Me, my theater sucks. I mean, check to see if they're streaming it on something. Because just because they're releasing it in theaters doesn't necessarily mean they won't release it on a, a platform. Doesn't um um I forget the sites with the, the the this company right here um Paramount. So, Paramount. Paramount. Streaming service. Okay, yeah. I think they have a streaming service, so they might do it on there. 
I am definitely looking forward to it. I guess I love this little fight scene right here. I, I like that and little little whipping and quip back and forward. Uh, but I'm I'm so scared that I'm gonna go to another theater and be like, oh, Adobe Sound and and uh, uh, um, what was the other thing I, I saw Mortal Kombat in? Yeah, AMAC or whatever. And I'm go there to be like trash. I'm gonna enjoy the movie, but I don't want the the experience to be ruined when I can just watch it at home and actually have the just a good of experience without having to spend an arm and leg and sit down in front of it and sit in a chair and get a bad experience. Just like not get what I what I'm what I'm hoping for. But I'm looking forward to this movie. I hope you are too, guys. Okay. So we'll be seeing this movie. Hell high water. I don't care if I go see it by myself, but I think my wife would see it too. She liked the movie, so. She goes to the movie, I think. Tell you, if my boys get wind of this trailer, I ain't gonna have a choice. <laughs> but you know, leave your comments down below. Who are you looking forward to? Who's your favorite character? And what little trope do you hope they put in the game? For anybody that's watching my stream right now, for anybody that's wondering, I stream every Wednesday, Fridays, and Saturdays at 7 to 8 o'clock Central PST time. Be sure to come check me out at twitch.tv forward slash Grumpy Bear. But those who are watching right now, don't go nowhere. I'm gonna do a little quick outro and we're gonna get back back into it. Time to look forward, but as always, have a good day, have a good night. Have a good life. Much love, y'all. And bye.